Hello avid royal followers, welcome back to the channel. In today's news, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex dramatically quit as senior working royals in March as they said they wanted more freedom to earn their own money. The couple has also spoken about the pitfalls of being in the royal family as their private lives were examined intensely, with Meghan admitting not many people had asked if she was okay after giving birth to son Archie. As part of the deal they struck with the Queen to step down, they said they would have a review a year later, in March 2021, so they can keep their HRH titles. Commentator Darren Grimes said he did not think the pair were giving up their duty in order to seek more privacy after their recent deals to make podcasts with Spotify and also earlier signed a reported £112 million deal with Netflix to make doc docuseries. He also compared the couple to Edward III, who abdicated from the royals for a private life, while Meghan and Harry appear to be taking the royals down as reality television route. He said, HRH, the Duke of Windsor, upon abdicating the throne to be with the woman he loved, understood what giving up the duty he was born into meant, and duly pursued a private life. I am afraid that HRH, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, have clearly rejected that model of reti reticence and rititude. No objective royal commentator can possibly argue that Harry and Meghan have given up their duties at rainy charity galas and events here in Blighty to pursue a more private life, moving from the service to their queen and country. No objective royal commentator can possibly argue that Harry and Meghan have given up their duties as rainy charity galas and events here in Blighty to their queen and country to instead pander the wokery in Hollywood as they weren't the main event and knew they would never be. With the new Fly on the Wall Netflix reality teleseries and a Spotify podcast series, Harry and Meghan risk turning the Windsors into the Kardashians. Mr. Grimes added he thought the pair should have their titles removed so that they don't risk the magic of the monarchy with their latest move. The Duke and Duchess revealed their new Spotify project earlier this week by releasing a trailer featuring them both chatting and joking with each other. Royal expert Penny Juna said the couple's new lucrative deals with Netflix and Spotify will be a huge help with supporting their new lifestyle. She said, They're living in an extremely expensive house with a lot of very expensive running costs and it's a very extravagant lifestyle. The big question when they moved was how were they going to support themselves? If this is a way of doing that, it's unusual for members of the royal family, but so is the whole situation. My feeling is slightly good luck to them. Don't judge them until it's all gone pear-shaped. So tell us what you think in the comments below. That is all for today's news and I'll see you next video.